I feel like this should be like an Alex Jones type voice. I feel like this is some conspiracy level stuff. So, uh, <clears throat> what does Alex Jones sound like? Lucky for you, readers, I have the scoop. I was working with a local detective. <laughs> I can't do it. I can't do it. Hello and welcome back to Mr. Red Play Simulacra. I had to jump my uh, uh, friggin' sleeves so they weren't, like, pulled all the way back like a little weirdo. But now I pulled them out, so now I have to pull them all the way. All right, guys, we're going to talk to Taylor. Busted. So we did speak with Cassie. Got it. I tracked down Cassie. It was very difficult. I had to look up a walkthrough. How would I <laughs> supposed to know that you were supposed to look through the Twitter posts, the Jabber posts, and she would tweet out her phone number? How was I supposed to know that? Whatever. That Jabber hottie, did she kiss and tell? Uh, he could predict her every move. Or her real name is Cassandra. Not the point. Also, yeah. Yeah, it's Cassie. He could predict her every move. Okay, so let's see what Taylor has to say. So he's either some next level stalker, or there's something to him that we don't really know. Never mind. We know now that James is maximum creep material. Perhaps creepy enough to kidnap Anna. Perhaps. Okay, you showed me yours, and I'll let you, me show you mine. I found something about James, too. Oh, okay. Freedom to alternative facts. Oh, God. Power through different truths. Oh, God. What the fake mass media do not want to see about the recent disappearances on dating apps. Wait, whoa, okay. I don't like this headline, or, or whatever this is going on here. Educate thyself. I don't think I like this website. But if it talks about the dating apps... Uh, first of all, I want to commend the local news coverage on escalating this horrible trend to a whole new level. Just when I thought, okay, my account was suspended. All right. All right. We're going to save that for a rainy day, or at least until I finish this article, whichever comes first. Uh, what do we say? Uh, just when I thought they couldn't sink any lower, they did, downplaying the seriousness of this issue and treating all the victims as just another statistic to be forgotten. Blaming these crimes on trivial things, such as the rise of the internet and the degradation of our youth, this has to be stopped! There's more to the story. And the people deserve to know the truth. Uh, I do not want you, my readers, to... <clears throat> I do not want you, my readers, to continue being brainwashed by the mainstream fake media. I feel like this... Pictured how far the story goes. All right, cool. I feel like this should be like an Alex Jones type voice. I feel like this is some conspiracy level stuff. So... Uh, <clears throat> what does Alex Jones sound like? Lucky for you, readers, I have the scoop! I was working with a local detective! <laughs> I can't do it. I can't do it. Uh, <laughs> a very trusted friend who I can't reveal his name to keep him safe and to see if there's any connections to the crimes and, oh boy, this is the rabbit hole deeper than Bill Gates' wallet. But why am I doing this? Because there's something strange going on with Spark! These big tech corporations are slowly taking over the world, selling our info to the governments to spy on us, and now paying off the media and law enforcement to silence our voices and to further pacify us into submission. So what is it this time? Scroll down a little bit. First of all, not all these crimes are fully represented. There are violent crimes and sexual crimes, but somehow the media fails to mention the missing crimes. Why didn't they use words like kidnapping or MIA. It's a safe assumption, right? Well, that's where they've screwed it up. Some of these missing crimes are not reported because they didn't treat them as crimes at all, but statistical anomaly. What the hell? Don't their families deserve some closure? Don't our children deserve safety? Why are these anomalies ignored outright? Is this the right? Hold on. Hold on. The game is over here. That's the right. But this is the right on my side. My right is this way, but your right is that way. Weird, right? It's like mirrors. Uh, okay, look at the graph that was hacked from an internal law enforcement report regarding these crimes. Oh, look at the spikesies in the missing. Age. Age. Notice something? A big yellow line. How long is this article? Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, look at this. Okay, James A., this is what we need to know. This is still developing, so I don't have much info about him. Here's what I can do. He's 25 and works as a copywriter, although he is technically missing. He is somehow still active on Jabber, yet no, so no one filed a report yet, but... It didn't stop there. His phone was found in someone's backyard and handed to the police as evidence. Now, this is where... Whoa. His phone was found? Uh-oh. I know a guy who knows a guy who's gone through his phone. They found a 
weird video of him with huge chunks of data missing. I am still trying to figure out... I'm still trying to get a hold of it. Something strange is going on and we can't count on the police, the government, and the media for this. Okay, so this is an Oxford comma here. I think that's what it's called when you have a list of things and the last thing is a comma between it and the second to last thing. And usually people are famous for leaving off the Oxford comma. This guy put in the Oxford comma, but not the regular comma that you should have had. The police, the government, and the media for this. It is up to us for the true believers. Here's my deductions. All the victims have something in common. Victims are like in the graph H between 21 and 25. There's a gender pattern. Girl, guy, girl, guy, and so on. They all seem to be bookworms of sorts, either studying or working in related jobs. They all broke up recently with their girl slash boyfriends and looking for love. Except James, but I'm willing to put money that he did too. Conclusion. I have no freaking clue. Is there a serial killer on the loose? Were they kidnapped and experimented on by the Serpent Society? More on this next week. Aliens abducting us to try and understand our new mating rituals? Probably not. Nothing is off the table. I feel like the aliens thing is off the table. Uh, until the law decides to take these small cases seriously. While we need to always be... Wait, wait, whoa. Let me try that one more time. While we need to be careful always... Want to go out with strangers? The people deserve to know that there are bigger forces at play here. Stay vigilant. You can count on me to show you the alternative truths. Oh, God. <clears throat> Alex Jones is back. I end today with the truth that I hear screaming in my head. Trust no one. There is only us against them. Don't trust the water in your pipes. Doubt your irises. <sighs> this has been Alex Jones talking. All right, guys, that was bizarre. I don't know what came over me. Anyway, we've been blocked. Our accounts have been suspended. Spark, new sign-in from unknown. Dear Anna, you've logged into your Spark account from unknown. For security reasons, we have logged you out of, from all devices to prevent further unauthorized access. That's different from suspending your account. Thank you. From X Heart X Heart. Well, I don't really care about that, do I? Can I not get in? Do I not know the password? I don't remember if this was already signed in when I first started. I shouldn't have done that with my voice because, ow. All right, cool. Well, we did it. A link you want me to read? Well, I just did. Why did I... Why wouldn't I do this first? Why don't I say this before I did it? Yep. You can read it at your own time. Uh, okay, but I will keep this quick. TLDR. What is the TLDR? Oh, this is such a long text. Can I get a TLDR from that text? James vanished a couple of months ago while on the way out to, wait for it, meet someone from Spark. Wait a second, a couple months ago? But didn't Anna disappear just a couple days ago? Another word about that. Well, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, that's sarcastic. Mm. Just like Anna. Hmm, now I'll put the pieces together. There's more. Okay, what's more? Oh, combine this with what you have found out. I think there is something bigger at works here. Oh, hello. Okay, Taylor, we're going we're gonna to listen to Taylor's message. We're going to find out what Taylor has to say. Taylor, tell me something. Okay, I need to record this so we are on Whoa, the Whoa, are you location. in a bathroom, so, Taylor? Uh, commencing epic monologue. Oh, God. He is. Anna. It sounds like he's taking a shower. James, they were both last seen going on a date or is, with raining? On Spark. Anna and James still had activity on Jabber, but no one has physically seen them. Has Anna done that? It's... The same pattern. James is still nowhere to be found. That's true. What do you mean? I hope Anna doesn't share the same fate. I hope so too. Okay. So, James had activity on Spark after he went missing. Or Jabber. Oh, did he say Jabber just then? Because I was going to say, if it was Spark, then I was also on Spark messaging people as her so maybe that's what anna was doing to james trying to solve his mystery and i'm next in the cycle and then somebody else is going to get this phone and it's going to be my phone but i'm not i don't have any connections with people so that would be a boring game for this I don't, i'm not in my life i'm very cool and popular <laughs> uh you're right i guess uh, what, what, about what? There are too many similarities, simulacra. Oh, that's nothing. Is it? 
Wait, there are too many similarities between Anna and James for it to be a coincidence. Whatever is happening right now is spooky AF. There's an imposter going around making people disappear, and I think he slash she slash they is assuming the identity of James. We gotta find him, and I think I know how. Let's hear it. Why don't I have a say? Well, because I don't know anything. I'm dumb. So let me check something real quick. Okay, cool. Uh, I'll get back to you. Awesome. Well, we'll talk to Taylor later. In fact, we'll talk to you later in the next episode, which is going to be tomorrow. Greg, God damn it. I'm hitting dead ends everywhere. Aren't you arrested? It's like she vanished from the face. New vlog available. Awesome. Well, that didn't seem to make sense, but we'll figure it out in the next episode. Guys, tomorrow, new episode of this simulacra, and then... In two days will be the next whatever I'm doing. I don't know what it is. Maybe you know what it is. Tell me if you know what it is. Leave a comment if you know what the next episode is. It's not Simulacra. And I will see you then. Um, I think what is going to happen is that Anna is going to kill me. That seems right. Look forward to that. And goodbye, everyone. Ha 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 ha